What's up, YouTube? So, in this video, I'm going to be talking about Marvin Wilson, um, defensive tackle out of Florida State. Um, this dude is absolutely fantastic. Um, he's not necessarily the most athletic in the world, but I don't really need him to be because he's going to be a nose tackle in my eyes. Um, but if you need a, a really nasty-ass nose tackle to stop the run, he is definitely your guy. He is powerful. He is mean. He is violent. Um, he's just fantastic. Like, and he do, he does not stop. His motor is really really good. Um, he's not necessarily the best pass rusher. He could definitely use some refinement there. You know, learning to defeat people with his hands a little bit more consistently. Uh, he does get his hands inside, but sometimes if he can't power through you or if his first move doesn't work, he kind of gets stuck. Uh, learning a couple more moves would be good. Um, he has shown to be able to do spin moves. He's pulled some cloth. He's pulled down on people's hands. Um, he just needs to do all those things a little bit more consistently. And I think we could really be looking at a premier player out, out of this guy. And right now, like he's not the best pass rusher in the world, but right now you can draft him and he, at the very least, will be a consistent run stopper for you. He absolutely blows plays up. Um, watching film, I seen him against, uh, Louisville, um, last year, he went up against Makai Becton and absolutely bullied that dude. Makai, being able to bully Makai Becton is insane to me. Um, he, he, he just beat the shit out of Louisville all day long. Like, I literally seen him put one hand on one offensive lineman and the other on another, and he literally bench-pressed them both back into the running back. It's crazy. Just powerful, nasty as hell, just fantastic. Um, like I said, he's not necessarily the most athletic in the world. He's not a complete, um, you know, trash can full of dirt, can't really move, but um, he is kind of leaning toward there. I think a good combine would really help him out even more. But um, uh, he's not necessarily slow for a nose tackle. I'm just trying not. I'm not. I'm just not trying to put him at three tech. Uh, now Florida State moved him out to edge, moved him to three four defensive end. They moved him around quite a bit, but I think he is best at nose for sure. Uh, it says he's only six five three zero one on uh, ESPN's website, but I don't buy it. He looks bigger. He plays bigger. Uh, he's bigger than that for sure. Um. He, he he's just nasty as hell. That's that's the way I would define him the most. Is just nasty, violent, aggressive. Ugh. the way he beats double teams on against the run so consistently is is just crazy to me. He he's just not gonna, you know. He's not gonna beat your guard and take off toward the quarterback. Um, for, for him to play three tech or even three four defensive end, I think. His best bet to me is playing one tech in a four three. But if a three four team does draft him, still put him in nose. He'll he'll do fine either way. And I have seen him handle double teams very effectively, like I said against Louisville. But that was just an extreme example. But he is also fantastic at two gapping. He is very intelligent. You can tell that his football IQ is there. Uh, he is a senior, so that kind of helps sometimes, uh, just having another year under your belt. Um, but his football IQ is, is really good. He doesn't fall for shit too much. Um, overall, he, he's just a fantastic player. Like I said, if you, can, if you can draft him right now and just let him stop the run and then during the off seasons progressively uh, work on him to make his pass rushing better, this guy could legitimately be one of the best defensive tackles in the league in a couple years. And I think he can step in and do work for you right now. Right now. Um, he's one of the best nose tackle prospects I've seen in a long time. Um, we had Brown last year, and Brown is more athletic, but this dude is just so fucking violent. Like, it, just two different types of players, really. Um. Yeah, he's he's one he's one of my early favorites so far. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be honest with you. Uh, I don't really see too many negatives because, like I said, he is a little bit slow, but he's gonna be playing nose tackle, so I'm not that upset about it. 
Um, but as far as where he's going to get drafted, I don't know. It's kind of tough to say because he's a really talented player, but nose tackles tend to fall. So we'll just have to see. So um, anyway, that's going to be it for this video. If you liked it, I appreciate you hitting that like button. If you have any questions or comments, leave in the comments down below. Subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.